Hey guys, it's Larry Greenberg, and today we're taking a look at the all-new Spigen SGP Neo Hybrid case for the iPhone 5. This case sells for $29.99, and there are a bunch of different colors from which to choose from. So as I open it, in addition to the case itself, you do get three of Spigen SGP's Jelly Home Button replacement stickers, a certificate of authenticity, and a little catalog about some of the other items Spigen sells. Unfortunately, you do not get a screen shield with this case. I do believe the original Spigen SGP Neo Hybrid case did come with a screen shield. For whatever reason, they do not include one any longer. So here is the case itself. Now, the original Neo Hybrid was one of my all-time favorite cases, and this one is much improved. So uh, let me show you it up close. There are two pieces to it, as you can feel my phone vibrating in the, or hear my phone vibrating in the background. There are two pieces to it, and I'll slide the phone into frame. A inner core, we'll call it, and then an outer frame. The inner core is one of the pieces that's been drastically improved. It now features the Spider-Man-like pattern through it, and that gives added shock and impact. The material itself is also more rigid. It's not as flexible. It doesn't want to fall apart. So first step is to pop the phone in place, like so, and then place the frame over it. The frame is also improved. Used to be flimsy. It's still flimsy. You're definitely going to have to be careful with it when you put it on, but it used to be very easy to crack it when you were putting it on. It seems a little bit tougher now, and I'm not going to say that like you can't crack it if you're not careful, but it does um, seem a little bit stronger. And that's how you would install it. Now, you do get some lay-on-the-table protection with this. Hopefully, you can make out that this lip here comes up above the screen of the phone so that if you put your phone down like this onto a surface, it's going to hit this lip first before it hits the glass. On the bottom, there are essentially four individual cutouts, per perforations, we'll call them, for the speaker and mic, and then a cutout for the lightning port and a cutout for the headset jack as well. The buttons, the sleep awake, and the volume up and down get covered and replaced by these metal looking buttons. They still give really nice feedback when you press them. And getting to the vibrate switch is no problem at all. It's totally accessible. There's a look at the back. You have a pill shaped cutout for the camera, secondary mic, and flash. And it's lined with a black liner to prevent flashback. And then the only other noticeable thing is the Spigen logo in the lower right hand corner. Essentially, guys, this has always been and to this day remains one of my all-time favorite cases for the iPhone 5. It was great before and with the improvements, and those include, again, the spider-like pattern in the inside, the reinforced frame, and better material for the core, we'll call it. All of those just contribute to make this an even better case. If you're an iPhone case user, one that you know collects more than one, this is definitely one you want to add to your collection. So that's been my brief look at the Spigen SGP, the brand new version of the Neo Hybrid. Again, it's available in a bunch of colors, $29.99. You can learn more about it via the link I'll put in the video description. Also down there will be the link to my full review of this over on runaroundtech.com. If you have any questions about what you saw here today, definitely drop me a line down below. Otherwise, have a great day.